Hey my beauties, welcome back and welcome back to another video. I'm pretty sure you guys saw today's title. I'm doing another TJ Maxx commercials. I do have some Dollar Tree items and I did go to Foreman Mills. I don't know if you guys have a Foreman Mills where you're from, but it's basically like a huge rainbow, but like the ghetto version. Yeah, that's the only way I can describe it. I just don't. I like rainbow, but you, you know, there's some ghetto rainbow. So this is just the ghetto version of rainbow. Yeah, that's what it is. I'm gonna start off with Dollar Tree. Uh, wait, let me, I have to buy some plates. Okay, what I got in here? Okay, I did get some Ioni lashes. Um, These are the, I don't know why these look so different to me, but I do have these. Um, I got three pack of those. So I only found one pack one pack of bolero facial wipes and everybody just seems to you know hype their wipes up and i just don't want to give in and i saw it i was like i need some wipes let me just try these and see how i like them um these are the watermelon sweet mint I, I'm, I'm gonna see how i like them but everybody just raves about it so we're we gonna see what y'all be what y'all be screaming about okay I don't know I can't do nothing with this this is the wet and wild caramel toffee um girl what is this contouring thingy yeah it was there it I don't know I can use this on somebody I did pick up this hard candy um this is all-in-one makeup palette and this is all-in-one Halloween makeup kit and includes six shades um you get white, black, pink, yellow, and purple and turquoise. But yeah, so I picked this up because I want to start doing some makeup looks, some Halloween makeup looks for next month so I can have them ready for October. So uh, yeah, I'm going to try to get at least two or three of them up. Hard Candy Green Lipstick. So this is just a green lipstick and it does come with a green liner. Ooh, pretty. This is beautiful. Look at that. This is the matte, matte. A holic. <laughs> I sound slow. Forming Mills. This is the store. That's the name of the store. I found some cute loungewear. Like so, the first thing that I found were some pair of shorts. These were a two pack of boxer shorts. These were only five ninety nine. So I love pizza. So they had these pizza shorts. So cute. Then they had these shorts with like makeup things on here like lipstick perfume is that a pencil i don't know why the pencil on here like what what am i writing like listen this is like a mumu like i don't own a mumu but to me this is like a, a mumu this is like a oversized this is a 2021 mumu okay look at this biggest softest shirt ever well, to me i was calling a moo, but i guess it's a shirt that's what came to mind when i seen it look look at this it's so cute it's so big y'all and it's a one size fit all that's why i like call it a moo. if you don't know what a moo, you know what a moo is what your grandma wear around the house they just throw it on yeah it's it's pretty long i'm gonna put one on tonight i'm so excited and it just has um lip gloss eyeshadow mascara nail polish on here these were $7.99 so i got this one this one says good morning so cute like i said they are one size fit all it's nothing no words on the back just the lipsticks um this was five dollars five dollars and this one girl it says the nap queen with the chanel like bottle they had blue gray and i want to say pink if i'm not mistaken i really want to say pink but i'm not sure but i had to get i had to get the gray so let's get into tj maxx and marshall so this was on clearance for eight dollars this is a pretty like off the shoulder dress and it's so long i it has a split on the side right here but um it's okay like it's okay on i feel like this is one of those dresses you wear to like you know in the backyard i was expecting it to fit a certain way but it's cute like i you know i kind of want to get some wear out of it before it starts um the weather starts changing so i got these these were six dollars oh it was five dollars 
$5 and I just got this nude pair. This would be so cute for next year. I found this cute jumpsuit and it was on clearance for $6. And I really like it. I like the back part, as you guys can see. And it does come with shoulder pads, which don't look bad. And yeah, that's how it looks in the front with the shoulder pads. And it's just long. Like I said, I probably will try this on because you can't really see. I saw this at the register. It was $7.99. Y'all, look, that is girly, right? So girly. I had to get it. I could not leave. Ooh, look at that. I could not leave up out of there without this doggone headband. Like, girl, is it crooked? Or is that my head? Ooh, I don't know. It look kind of crooked. <laughs> so here's the dress. It's like off the shoulders. Really, really cute. The color, the color is what is making me so excited. And what I like about it is it has some buttons right here and you can make the split as high as you want to. It's so pretty. And then it has these ruffles at the bottom. I love that. And then you can like make the waist a little bit tighter. This dress is perfect. I don't know if I just said the price or not. It might've been $8. I don't think I did. I don't know. I don't remember. <laughs> it's $8. The Becca Light Shifter Finishing Veil. To me, it look like it will work. This is in the color Light Fall 6 in the store. That's what I didn't I don't know what this is. This was $12.99. And I don't know. It's a finishing powder, okay. But I don't know why to me this look like it might be my color. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be light. Yeah. I don't know. Like that look like I can do something with that. Let me swatch it. I didn't I haven't swatched it yet. See if I can. Oh, jackpot. Because I just, I'm glad I picked this up because I just figured it looked kind of dark though. We're going to see if we can bronze with that. I picked up this Laura Geller Bake Gelato Swirl Illuminator and Ballerina. And I don't think I ever tried their highlighters and I always wanted to. Because I was it Gilded Honey or something like that? And that was like really, really popular watch it right here Ooh, that's pretty that's kind of reminding me of a highlighter I already have that's really pretty kind of dry I got this honest beauty deep hydration eye cream it's on clearance for 550 bare minerals under over lip liner in the color wired and this was $4.99 this is a really, really nice deep red for the fall time. Then I got some lip products from Lime Crime. These are the Ultra Shiny Lip Gloss. This is the Wet Cherry line. And I wanted to try something from this line when it came out. These are $6.99. I got the color Unripe Cherry. So yeah. That is the color right there. That's going to be so pretty. And then this one is Flamey Cherry. All right, so here's that color. So yeah, I'm excited about those. Then I found this Anastasia Lip Gloss in the color Venus. And this is, this was $4,599. That's pretty. Oh, I got one more thing. From Lime Crime. This was $6.99. This is in the shade Buffy. It's like um looks like a muted brown, but the packaging is frosted. So oh, it's kind of watery. Oh, that is oh, I hope I find another one. Oh, that's giving me like peanut butter vibes. Like seriously. Oh, that's pretty. That's gonna be so pretty with a brown lip liner. Alright, I got a hole in this bag. Well, it's ton like it's tons of stuff in here, okay? All right, so I got this Laura Mercy A um, Cream Eye Detail Brush for $4.99. Flat brush. Oh my God, I should have got another one. And I hope I find one because this would have been good for like, even like this eye look I have now, like I could have just used it for that, you know? So it would have been good for that purpose. Oh, I did get a wallet. 
um, $7.99 from Juicy Couture. I needed a wallet so bad. My purse that I'm wearing right now has no pockets, so I'll be digging for my cards. So I needed that. I got the uh, Revolution um, palette. This was $6.99 at TJ Maxx. And this is the Friends collection. I really like the color scheme. I never, I watch Friends sometimes, but not like, but I really like the color scheme. And I like Makeup Revolution 10 palettes. I picked up this organizer from TJ Maxx. It was $9.99. And this is from Bino. I have, y'all know I love that brand. And I know you guys have some things from them too, but I found this one. Um, I don't know if, I doubt it, it was with like another thingy like another organizer because it was just by itself and it was just it's, it was just priced ten dollars so i was trying my hardest trying to find another one i couldn't i love big drawers i don't like small drawers like i love wide drawers i was trying to find organizers with big wide drawers no separators i love that space i need that space and if i can find three more of these to make a four tier organizer that'd be so lovely so yeah oh my god you can fit like your setting powders in here like oh i really hope i can find another one but yeah before we get back into the makeup because i'm going to forget i also found this perfume little tray so if you guys remembered i purchased the round tier tray so let me show y'all what some perfume will look like on top of here because this is so cute you can put like your high-end foundations you can put um your nail polishes up here so it's just the right size let me put some perfume on here so you guys can see um if you have the dossier perfumes you could put them up here this one is from target you can't put tall perfumes on the second and third row but this first row you can but just to give you guys a look of what it will look like like if you have some chanel perfume ysl or something it'll look so good displayed up here so yeah i just kind of want to share that with you all like oh it's so pretty 70 cents for this lip balm this is from rebels refinery and i have this in the black packaging already and i don't use it i just bought it for the packaging because shaped like a skull so it's just white and i have the black one so i picked it up this was two dollars this is the lime crime lip gloss um what is this lime crime iridescent lip topper for two dollars and this is in the color cleopatra okay anastasia beverly hill liquid glow highlighter for two dollars and this is in the color patina and that's ooh, ooh, that's nice i can put that on my eyes okay so yeah, got that. And Laura Geller Baked Gelato Swirl Illuminator. This wasn't on Markdown, but $4. It might be soon. This is in the color Pixie Pearl. Now this one is in the big packaging. I haven't swatched this one yet. I'm excited about these Laura Geller um, highlighters. And this one's kind of dry. Oh, that's cute though. Yeah, it has that dry to the touch feeling, but it's very pigmented. But I could definitely use it as an eyeshadow or... And like my inner corner, the Stila Double Dip Suede Shade and Glitter Glow Liquid Eyeshadow, $2. Okay, so when I open this, this is in the color of Beach Wave. When I open this, this all that came out, just this. I was like, I know damn well that this is not, like Stila did not package this little thing in this. I just don't see them doing that. So when I'm like... I suede shade and glitter and glow it's missing a product i'm like oh, this should have been 50 cent i still would have picked it up so it's missing the glitter part which that would have been the glitter oh my god y'all i would i would have put that on my eyes like seriously i would have been so happy with that glitter but it's missing okay but this is the blue cl um, color right here oh this is oh Oh, that's gonna be beautiful, like a beautiful base. This, okay, so this is the Becca Light Gleam Primer and Topper Liquid Eyeshadow. This is in the color Laser. This was $5.50. And this is the color. And here you go. Those are the topper shades. 
all those colors look pretty this is the becca light gleam uh, primer topper thingy again this is in the color dusk and this was two dollars i don't know why that was 550 but still got it anyway so this one i can't wait to wear this is definitely giving me fall vibes this is another primer topper um from becca golden hour two dollars now i'm wondering why that one was five dollars pretty so pretty look at that this is stila little white lies liquid eyeshadow for two dollars pretty color <gasps> oh girl oh that first swatch was something else oh my god oh oh that is pretty Oh, that's like a white gold color or something. Yate London Wonder Wand Gel Cold Liner for a dollar. Okay, hon? A dollar. This is in the color Peter. You know, <clears throat> I need some water. You need to, <laughs> this is the brush so you can fix the, you know, you know what I'm trying to say. And then this is the pencil. So, yeah, that's a cute little gray color. I picked up this Buxom Full Force Plumping Lipstick. Um, this was $6.99. Um, $6 this is in the shade Goddess. I was, I haven't swatched this yet. It's like, ooh, that looks too pink. But this is like a pinky nude color, apparently. Let me see what that looked like. Mm, I should have left this at the store. But that's too pink. We'll see how long I keep that. This is the Cream Shop um, Powder Bronzer in Tiki Bikini. And this is $3.99. Um, forgot I picked this up, but I feel like this has potential if it was a tad bit darker. But it kind of looks like a face powder. Yeah, it's not giving what I needed to give. Oh, oh my God. So this lip gloss, like I want to say like maybe two weeks ago i had this in my hand i didn't want to pay eight dollars for it. i think it was like eight nine dollars or something i didn't want to pay that much for it and guess what i went back it was three dollars i was like that's what i'm talking about this is in the color vibe it's from this brand called laritzy laritzy cosmetics i don't know that's that but it's a pretty nude color that's the nude color right there so pretty another liquid eyeshadow uh, I guess it's in the wrong packaging, but it's this was two dollars too. So this is in the color Bust the Mauve. So pretty, I like that plummy color. That is really pretty. I know a few of you all tell me what you find at the store, but I I do read my comments and I want to be on the lookout for certain things, and um, cause I ain't trying to miss a beat, okay? Cause if I can get it on sale why not okay so make sure you guys head over to every time i film somebody want to do something uh-uh what the hell going on anyway but anyways i'll talk to you guys later thanks for watching and subscribe if you're new here and i'll talk to you guys later bye